Good morning, church. Now, I don't know how many of you are smelling this um, stinky smell, but yeah, I was just wondering when I came in, it was very pungent, and oh, we were all closing our doors like this. And then I was wondering how would it be when Father just hugged that, that son who left home and came after so much time. You know what a loving uh, thought it is. We are just closing our nose like this, but then that day when uh, the parable of father and son, then the son came, the son comes and then father hugs him. He, he is so much delighted to see him, even though he's smelling bad. You know, that, that is whom we praise, right? And we have come here, we have come here to praise this name who loves us so much, right? So yeah, today, today uh, this will be our theme for worship. Grace will guide you home. You know, often um, if you realize uh, we don't really uh, set our hope and we don't really uh, think, which, think about the things which are unseen, but we are so much spending our time, so much spending our energy in things which are seen. And uh, what are we supposed to do as a Christian? Where do we find our destination? Are we preparing for it? So how can we know that we will arrive at our destination finally? How are we sure that we will one day go to heaven? Are you sure about it? So if you, if you are walking on foot, you'll probably need landmarks to walk by. And then if you are uh, driving a car, you, you probably need a GPS to direct your life or direct your, direct your destination. But what about Christian life? What do we need uh, to find our destination? So let us remind ourselves through this worship session that we have to remember uh, who turns our pages of our life, who, who writes our story, right? And we have to remember that uh, one who led us this far will lead us home. So the grace will lead us home. So let us sing this song, My Redeemer Lives. It's a very known song. Can we all rise up? Uh, My Redeemer Lives is, a, lives is a very familiar phrase which Job uses in the midst of all his sufferings. When he, he goes crazy, you know, Job, Job 19, it says, uh, he says all the things, your anger is, Lord, it's making me die, it's making me cry. And then it's in the midst of all these sufferings, in the midst of all these writings, he writes this, but I know my Redeemer lives. So can we say this thing in the, in the midst of our sufferings? Can we sing this song? Thank you. 
Next, next song, Nothing But The Blood Of Jesus. Come on, just sing it as if you mean it, right? Yep. Nothing but the blood of Jesus What can make me whole again Nothing but the blood of Jesus Oh, precious is the flow That makes me white as snow No other forms I know Nothing but the blood of Jesus song we're gonna sing is a hymn um, in the sweet by and by it's a blessed hope to think that God is preparing a home for us so this song reminds us that he is preparing a home for us so there's one song which I came across it reads like this home a distant shore waiting me home city that you are building for me home where we lay aside our weeping Home where there is no night or sorrows, where even death is swallowed. So as we await to, wait, await to go there, can we sing this song in a reminding way?
beautiful show. We shall sing on that beautiful show. The melodious songs of the blessed, and our spirit shall sorrow no more. Nor is time for the blessing of rest. In the sweet by and by. He's done till now in our lives. How much love it takes to just sacrifice Himself for us. Can we all take this moment and thank Him in our prayers? Yes, Lord, we thank you, Lord, for the love. Though we mess up, Lord, thousand times, though we promise to you that we won't do things again, we won't sin again, but Lord, we fall into the same sin, Lord. But Lord, we thank you, Lord, that you have been patient with us. Lord, we thank you, Lord, that your love never fails. Lord, if it fails, Lord, where are we, Lord? Lord, we thank you, Lord, for your mercies. Help us to recognize them, Lord. We thank you, Lord, for these little blessings you give us. Help, us. help us to thank you for them, Lord. Help us to count our blessings, Lord. Help us not to miss any blessing you give us, Lord. Help us to grow more in your love. Beneath the weight of his weight and 
this day is purely your grace oh lord thank you lord for your love that is so abounding lord jesus thank you lord for each one of each one of us here lord jesus seeking your grace seeking your help to go through this next week oh lord thanking you for what you have done throughout the last one week oh lord thank you lord we are nothing lord jesus but you have brought us from nothing to this oh lord thank you so much oh lord thank you so much I ask this prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. When we meditate upon your love, Father, we have no words to show our gratitude to you, Lord, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son that whoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting love. Lord, we not so unworthy Yet, Lord, for our sakes, you sacrificed your only begotten Son, that we may not perish, Lord, but have everlasting life. Yes, Father, 
what did we do to for all this love nothing lord it is just your grace lord we thank you lord for your abundant love because you loved us to the end lord not just the beginning father you picked us from the pit of dirty sins and washed us and loved us yes lord we cannot return your love as much you have loved us father one day lord we will come and fall prostrate at your feet and kiss your feet and express all our gratitude and love for you yes lord we are waiting for that day when our eyes our very eyes and flesh will see you and express our love to you when we kiss the wounds of your son in his hands for the sacrifice of your love in jesus name we offer our praises amen, amen. your the opportunity to worship you because lord there was nobody to take any initiative for us lord no angel could have done it nobody could have done it but lord you took the initiative and you came down lord that you took a low place when we are so much struggling to lower ourselves lord you took a low place lord you would become lower than the angels who stood in front of you father and you be you became that for me for us this morning lord and when you see our reluctance i don't know what you think about it lord when we we are unwilling to become small for you father and yet this morning lord without anything holding you back you are here with us this morning and lord you are gathered with your people lord whom you are sanctifying lord you are with us lord and father we want to praise you thank you lord for your presence thank you lord for your abundant love upon us lord thank you because when we acknowledge it lord something amazing happens to us and lord we are you are transforming more and more people to become worshipers we thank you lord for that thank you lord this morning that heaven is resounding with your praise of god and there is so much happening so much so much worship that even the pillars of heaven shake under that worship of mighty god father we also want to join with those amazing voices this morning and worship you and praise you from the bottom of our heart and hold back nothing from you this morning and we exalt you lord we exalt you because you are worthy of all exaltation all praise and everything oh god in jesus name amen so many times to live up to what god has called us to be and uh, but in the midst of all this uh, trauma he goes through he feels this sense of mercy and grace from god so sometimes our lives when we go through certain things it's just that it just brings us close to god and it it reminds us how much we are in need of god and it, it it reminds us that his grace and mercies are always there i mean we can more appreciate his grace and mercies in our times of trouble and he believes that putting god's will above his will is a best thing to do and he also says uh losing himself to praise him is what his motto is so let's sing Well, while while we are singing this song just try to understand the lyrics and meditate on it Should I 
bringing you praise everlasting your light will shine when all else fade never ending your glory goes beyond the things my heart and my soul I give you control God, we thank you, Lord, for this time of worship. We thank you, Lord, for the reminders you give us, Lord, in this walk of Christian life. Lord, may we never forget why we are here, Lord. Lord, uh, help us to uh, set our priorities, Lord, that we would choose to praise you, that we would, uh, we would long to meet you, Lord, that day when, we, when you come, Lord, that day when you take us, Lord. Thank you, Lord, once again for these reminders. Committing the rest of service into your, into your hands, Lord. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. <laughs> 